Now let's start off with some real basics. We're not going to try and solve these logical problems. We're just going to see how to set up the truth table. Okay, we'll start with a very simple two-bit problem. Just two variables, not A and B. So we've got two variables. Now in binary maths, what would two bits potentially give us? It can give us four different solutions. Okay, so we have four possibilities and we're going to divide those four possibilities into true and false. Okay, the first one, in this instance not A, we're going to start with two falses, that's zero, zero, followed by two trues, one, one. And for the second one, we're going to halve that pattern with zero, one, zero, one. We can see the first column has half false followed by half true. Let's look at a more complicated problem. What do you think will happen when we have three parts to our logic problem? That's right, there are eight alternatives with three bits. Look at the numbers here and the numbers that appear in the truth table. Can you see a match? You can draw out your truth table either using the pattern where you divide the first column first into zeros and then ones evenly and then for the next one you halve that so in this instance two zeros two ones two zeros two ones and then in the third one halve it again so one zero one 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 zero one one or as you can see from the counter just start adding from nothing one two three bingo I hope you think I hope that helped.